Enoch 1 verse 9. And behold, he cometh with ten thousand of his holy ones to execute judgment upon all, and to destroy all the ungodly, and to convict all flesh of all the works of their ungodliness, which they have ungodly committed, and of all the hard things which ungodly sinners have spoken against him. Leviticus 18, verse 27. For all these abominations have the men of the land done, which were before you, and the land is defiled. Deuteronomy 22, verse 5. The woman shall not wear that which pertaineth unto a man, neither shall a man put on a woman's garment. For all that do so are abomination unto the Lord thy God. Enoch, two, Enoch 6, verse 2. And the angels, the children of the heaven, saw the lost after them, and said to one another, Come, let us choose us, wise from the amongst the children of men, and beget us children. Enoch 5, verse 7 But for the elect there shall be light and joy and peace, and they shall inherit the earth. Enoch 22, verse 9 10 and 11. And he answered me and said unto me, These three have been made that the spirits of the dead might be separated, and such a division has been made that the spirits of the righteous, in which there is the bright spring of water, and such has been made for sinners, when they die and are buried in the earth, and judgment has not been executed on them. In their lifetime, here their spirits shall be set apart in the great pain till the great day of judgment and punishment and torment of those who curse forever and retribution for their spirits. <laughs>